Hello guys, welcome to another episode of Frank's Handyman. Today we're gonna be working here on these countertops. We're gonna be putting some laminate material. The other ones were already cracked. So we're gonna put uh, this new one right here. Right now they're doing the measurements. Uh, that way they could just also lay it over on the sheets and then they're just gonna do the markings right now and then draw out the line. That way they're able to cut it down with a blade. So right now he's gonna measure this right side and then the left side. And as you can see there, he has a marking now. All he has to do is use a blade and then just cut the piece of sheet as you see right now. And you see the white part right here, they're gonna peel off a little bit. And then as they move on towards the left side, they're gonna keep peeling it off. But you don't wanna peel off the whole thing because then if it sticks to something, then you have to rip off the whole thing. And this type of material rips really easily. So you have to be really careful when putting it on. And now y'all can see, these are the material that they're using to take out the air bubbles. Like I said, you have to go really slowly and then just take out the air bubbles because if you do it too fast, like I mentioned, you could crack the material and then it's just not gonna look good. It's gonna look ripped. So you have to be really careful and diligent when putting on this type of material. how this section came out looking so far but as you can see this is the reason why we had to replace it you can see all those cracks there we're gonna have to take out all the computers here we're gonna have to unscrew everything uh, and this is how the other side came out looking fully it looks pretty nice looks pretty clean like I mentioned you just have to be really careful when putting it on so really one of the things that took us a little bit longer to do was to disconnect all the uh, computers there and then disconnect all the wires because we had to use a bunch of screws and also uh, like I mentioned, just take off all the cracked pieces off. So you're going to see the whole process of how that goes right now. Once we took everything off, we had to wipe off the whole surface really nicely because like I mentioned, it's a delicate type of material. So you don't want anything on there that might leave bumps or anything like that. So you have to really wipe off the surface really well. And again, they're going to repeat the same steps as far as doing all the measurements on the left and the right side. That way, this piece of sheet is going to fill in really well. And this is how it's coming along compared to the other side this one had some little holes on there where all the wires went in for the computer so they're gonna have to just you know take those off that way they're able to fill in those gaps when it comes down to putting all the wires back on and as well 
they're gonna have to just be more diligent towards the corner because as you see there's that little wall right there so they're gonna have to be careful when ripping that off as well because like I mentioned this type of material rips really easily so like I said if you want to do this type of material you have to be really diligent and be also careful and slowly when you're working with it and this is how this section came off after this section now we're gonna move into the middle part and as well there's a lot of things that we have to remove a bunch of computers uh, one of the printers and so right now we're gonna focus on just taking everything off and then taking apart this whole material right here this one was a little bit more difficult just because as you see that crack there on the edge uh, we're gonna have to take this whole thing apart and so we're gonna have to need a well it's, it's just like a hot gun in a way because it's different than the other material here so we're gonna have to use a hot gun uh, that way we could uh, warm up the whole surface and then slowly start peeling it off and you're going to see the whole process right now as well on how they do that, that whole process. This is how it looked once we took everything off and then as well we have to just make sure that there's no little bumps there's not really any type of debris on the surface so we really have to wipe it off really well as well just doing all the measurements right now because we have to make sure that there's like like i said there's no debris under there otherwise this type of material you, you're going to see the bumps on there and right now they're just going to do the cuts and then as well just put on the whole uh, sheet on there as well and it's going to come out looking really great and tomorrow we're also going to have a whole new project so stay tuned for that i hope you guys enjoyed the rest of the video and i hope to see you guys tomorrow